What do you expect to see when you come to Hiroshima? To be honest, the first time I came here, I expected to see a city that had been completely devastated by the first atomic bomb ever and that still mourns its victims. I was prepared to see the traces of the tragedy everywhere around the city. I didn't see a city full of sadness, but instead a city full of energy. I saw people living their everyday life in a big, well-developed metropolis. People shopping, laughing, just living normal life. I found it interesting that even the ruins of the atomic bomb dome, which were preserved to commemorate the victims of the bombing, are called the Hiroshima Peace Memorial and not War Memorial. The Peace Memorial Park, which was built on an open field created by the explosion, is now a place where parents come to play with their kids and school students bring paper cranes to pray for peace. One of the memorials in the park is a girl holding a crane origami. It tells us the story of Sadako Sasaki, who was only two years old when the bomb was dropped close to her home. When years later she got leukemia, she believed that if she folded 1000 paper cranes, she would survive. Like many other kids, she didn't. Also striking is how many American flags I saw in the city. Indeed, you do not feel hate or anti-American sentiment here. This is what one of the atomic bomb survivors thinks about it. あの、外国の質問とか被爆者として あの、空から死の灰が、死が降ってきたとかいう表現されて、もう曖昧なことであって、思うのはやっぱり国としてはね、ああいう非人道的なね、原子爆弾というものを使ったことについては絶対に謝ってほしいんですよ。謝ってほ
Oh, this uh, pilot. Pilot, yeah. His mother's name. He named the plane Enoragei after his mother's name. Because before the bombing, he looks very happy. Yeah. He proud of this decision and the dropping. Ah. And as after the bombing, he got a medal mm -hmm. from a commander yes. because of he's the first army to drop him this weapon in the world. Yes. And after the bombing, over uh, almost 80 or 90 percent, the Americans believed it was necessary to finish the war. And it was mm -hmm. correct. So people supported these decisions. Masaki shares an important message that there are still more than 15,000 nuclear weapons in the world and that Hiroshima should remind us of its danger. In the center of the park you can find the Peace Memorial Museum. It has preserved clothes, toys and other things which demonstrate us the strength of the explosion. So we just came from the museum. I was standing in front of the eternal flame over there and what did you think of it Liv? It feels pretty surreal to be honest to go to a museum first and to see the extent of the devastation caused by the atomic bomb and you see Hiroshima city lying in ruins and uh, mm. injuries on people's body and you feel so extremely impressed and emotional but the moment we go outside of the museum we come to this beautiful park and there are kids playing here and life goes on and of course it is a great message and it is also a bit surreal in the sense that it's hard to imagine which that what we saw in the museum is this city now is the exactly same city we are walking through now and it gives you hope because life goes on and you can overcome even very scary things and human beings are able to rebuild the cities and to recover yeah, gives you hope in japan hiroshima is also famous for its traditional dish hiroshima yaki a special type of savory pancakes which combines meat cabbage and other vegetables with japanese noodles soba or udon Bon appetit, or as they say it here in Japan, itadakimasu. In the evening, you should walk through the city and experience just how laid back and easygoing people here are. The streets are busy with food stalls and bars. And Hiroshima has probably the most amount of street artists I have ever seen in Japan. And this is exactly how Hiroshima is nowadays. Young, vibrant and energetic. Like it?